All right, follow video indeed. I guess I'm going for this one. If this gets uploaded tomorrow or tonight, we'll know for sure. But in this video, we're going to talk a little bit about three things or reasons why I may not make content the way I think I would. So we're gonna start this off with energy lost before creating. This is in almost too direct relevance to my uh, no fucking senior touch and journey again. Sorry, we're rehashing that, but this is my channel, so I'm gonna go with it. Because I mean, I, I know what I'm talking about. For those of you who are maybe turned off by saying me saying that, hopefully you'll get the, the, the gist of it. But the rest of you who are there for hearing me say that, yes, that is in direct re revelation with my PMO addiction. So, um, but it also has other things tied to it. So like, but it, for the ex for the examples imposed by. <laughs> I would say claymation, uh, by no fap and uh, senior attention. The idea is that if I relapse, it is almost unbearably impossible to start up even just recording a video like this. If I have to get their energy back up from sleep or from uh, nutrients or from gathering my uh, sexual energy back together, you know, it's not impossible literally, but it just makes it seem trickier and harder. This is the same way I I I, I can see the idea that. PMO didn't ruin my life, but it made things trickier and harder to deal with. So, uh, but I lose a significant amount of energy and even discipline, motivation, and, and mental clarity over things if I read up to PMO, for example. And that leads to me not making content as easily or as uh, uh, consciously as I could be. And it's, um, again, not just with PMO, but with like things like whatever I happen to spend time and energy on at the moment. Maybe some of my content creator friends and allies are right when they say that I have a life and I should probably honor that more, if not completely before getting content. But for to me, content creation is my life. However, I have had times where I got screwed over in ways more than one, as is maybe you, you would guys would say is life. Some of you would say is life. But who, nonetheless, I do think that uh, these things are what having energy lost before creating is one of the reasons I don't make content legitimately. So... Uh, the second item is second guessing my goals. This is kind of also relevant to the last video I guess I made just, just earlier, earlier earlier today, which was the uh, not not the niche don't change video. That's the other video before, but the last video after that is uh, about the ten variety topics that I would make if, it, if they weren't relevant to soft skills and sound creation all all the same. Second guessing my goals, you know, just basically being like not overcomplicating things necessarily, but being like where. I, I, a hard spot where I'm thinking that it would basically be me just uh, wondering if I, my heart was in the right place or even if it as I know I tend to almost always know what I'm doing but as someone who still gets confused all, all the time as you may imagine with a clarity in Storm Bay not just with my abstinence journey but you know uh, second guess my goals would be like things like wondering if I actually was trying to seek passion instead of talent as was suggested with claymation there you go no, not claymation but uh, uh, but claymation could be something I, I enjoy doing um, the soft skills and science communication could be something I'm talented in but the second guessing my goals is more relevant because it happens to be the case that I don't have to know what I'm doing to do it right and vice versa I've done a lot of things wrong but I still had good intentions. And there's a huge backstory behind that stuff. So I'll leave it that open ended for that. Uh, third item is service to others versus my well being. And you guys know how this works quality versus over quantity or consistency over uh, top notch overly edited videos or however the controversies work in that favor. But, uh, you know, that's just one end of it. But, you know, my well being, it's not that I ever had YouTube burnout before. It's not necessarily that I ever had, like, to be like, oh, you're clearly not in the headspace to make videos. Well, I mean, I could be, but... Oh, wait, am I saying that myself? Okay, whatever. But, uh, service to others versus my well-being. It's not always a black and white co contrast to have myself be on the brim and burdened and troubled because I have to provide something if I can, if anything, but also making sure I can be happy even if it doesn't necessarily mean I'm actually being too selfish or too nice. Because there's a way to be too selfish, obviously, but there's also a way to be too nice. There is. Everyone knows what the liar is like. Like, well, I mean, not everyone, but like everyone knows what the what, how, what what it's like to be selfish. But also, everyone, particular people like me, know what it's like to be too nice. And I've had the the idea of being too truthful and being well, truthful can be its own controversy and lies a lot. Lying, stealing, cheating. I want to defend stealing and even cheating at some point, but lying that has its own gambit for being uh, reasonable or not. But with being too nice is basically like you're having to, as relevant to that item, it's having to basically be the kind of person where you don't even know how to help yourself anymore because you're trying to not 
hurt pe- other people at the same time. So th- that's a, a really relatable enough, not just unique in anyone's case. Like, I mean, I wouldn't have to say anyone's case, but you know. Yeah, that's the three items I wanted to go with. I did, I could have done two more, but that's I do I traditionally just five items. There's three items from this video. And we'll leave it at that. I'm not going to apologize for making two videos in a row like this, but this I, I enjoyed making these videos lately. I, they, they are very non-specific. And they're not even beginning to delve into like soft skills design communication, but or even write content as as is suggested. But I enjoy making these videos, believe it or not. There's it gets way deeper than this, by the way. It gets way deeper. I I could I could elaborate that in the meantime if I can if I can. But there's there's a reason why I do these things. So I don't have a slogan yet. I mean I could still use the old one, the uh, the newer older one, but you know the one with the accepting toy thing, desperation, turn down to care. But yeah, and then the. So much on the move or save on the pandemic, everyone. So, yeah, bye guys.